Hello, dear friend. Uh, today I want to show you a mini brushless DC pump uh, with six watts as rated wattage. So it's a mini one in my hands. You can see it, right? Uh, this model is 160 model. Rated wattage, six watts. And the working current is about 0 0.35 amps at six watts. So totally speaking, uh, it's quite uh, low power, only less than two watts. Yeah, right. Uh, th this one, it, this is is in net with external diameter of eight point two millimeters, and this is is external uh, outlet. You can see that there exists anti slip insert. For if, uh, for convenience in connection with uh, pipe, yeah, anti-slip. This one, I will show you. And on the base, we can see there exist three removal rem suckers. These suckers can be removed if not necessary. Yeah, uh, because of the suckers, so pump can be easily clean to some smooth surface or on the wall on the wall yeah or in this bucket so it's quite useful when in some small household or fit tank or relevant applications right although this is a mini one uh, I, I think that its performance is not so mini and uh, can be taken as somewhat powerful. Well, I will show you after being connected with external power supply. Okay. Uh, what we are using is this power supply, AC DC power adapter. Okay. Open the power supply. And now this is wattage. This is current indicator. And we will adjust the what output voltage to 6 watts because it's rated voltage of the pump okay one 6 watts yeah now we will connect the pump with the power supply with the power supply red is positive black is negative I will connect Okay, now pump has been connected, but uh, at this time the pump is in dry work status. Of course, we have to say long-term dry work is bad to the pump and it's not advised and accepted in applications. Uh, here I will just show you the noise and uh, some performance. Yeah, so we dry work for a while, little while. We can feel its noise. And we can see the working current when in dry work status is 0 0.18 amps. Well, as we mentioned, dry work is bad for the pump. So we locate the pump under the water. Okay. Under the water. And it starts pump water. When pump is located under water, we can see the working current becomes about 0 0.33 amps. So totally speaking, uh, this pump's power consumption is less than 2 watts. 2 watts in power consumption. Okay, let us check its performance. Spring, okay. Yes, and uh, let's feel its noise class. Note that this pump can be suitable for located under the water. 
yeah, rain applications, submersible installation. Also, it can be connected with an external tube or hose, but make sure that this pump cannot be self priming so it's essential to keep that the water can actively and smoothly flow into the inlet of the pump. Pump that works with high speed rotation of its impeller to push or throw the fluid out to get the effect of circulation or pressure pressurization. Yeah. Of course uh, it's a mini mini one. Uh, suitable for various micro applications or medical device, industrial device. Yeah. You can use it when you want to use it. Okay. Uh, of course, relevant pump product can also be customized for certain parameter requirements. Uh, just based on certain MOQ. Yeah. And certain that time. Uh, so, my friend, if you are interested, you can contact us via Skype or some other ways, no problem. Our Skype is S H Y S K Y T E C H, Shy Sky Tech. Well, this mini pump. Let's finish today's video. And thank you for your time. Bye bye.